We have a lot in common with the CSA. We predominantly represent public sector workers, a lot of those in the Commonwealth Public Service and many in government business enterprises, statutory authorities and so on. We've got a lot of members who do, as Tony said, do very similar work to you. And we share a lot of the same challenges. How do you build a really strong, powerful union that can take on governments, that can take on big fights, that can actually ensure that people get what they want as unionists and as people in the community? We started to see that we really needed to be a different sort of union to be more effective, able to take on the big fights, but also to do the day-to-day -day stuff. You know, We actually need to be a union that is absolutely embedded in the workplace because you cannot lock out a union that is led from the workplace. We are under attack, the things that matter to our members are under attack, and we need much more power and capacity to take those fights on. We need more members, we need much more, much higher proportion of public servants to be members of the union. We need to be an active union, we need to be a union that can run multiple campaigns at the same time, big campaigns, tough campaigns, but also do that really important day-to-day -day stuff that people actually rely on their union for. How on earth are we going to do all of that? Because, like you, our union, you know, um, faces the challenge where there has been a lot of public sector workers who think we do a reasonable job, but they're not necessarily members. So as we did that, we took that debate out to our delegates, which is what you're doing now, and in fact to our organisers and staff, and said, look guys, we need to change, and this is why. We want to actually take public services as being a core and fundamental part of a decent democratic society. And we want to back that in, we want to change, we want to change politics, we want to change what's possible. So as we did that, we actually talked to people about, well, what are you up for? What are you up for? What are you prepared to do? What's doing now is that we have an incredibly big, strong group of delegates who are leading the charge in our union in the workplace and increasingly in the community and political and community campaigning.